Wait. The Frog or the Prince? Chapter 4 of Episode 1 Complete. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Just humor me. Let's just keep our focus on questioning Lawrence. Where she was, who she was with, that sort of thing. I, I mean, I didn't... I didn't pick a choice in time. That was my bad. Let's knock on the door. Try and be polite. Hey, open up. It's Bigby. I need to talk to you. Let's see if I can just get in. Lawrence, you in there? I guess not. Um, oh, look, a window. I talked to Snow. Let's see. Windows cracked. Hey. Hey. Uh, it doesn't look good. Let's just go ahead in. Right. I'll try this out. Guess we're out of options. Come on, help me up. That does not sound good. There's a gun. Oh man, he's dead. That makes two fables dead. We need to figure out what the hell is going on here. Who would do this to them? Oh my god. I don't know, Snow. I don't know what to say. <laughs> kind of in shock. And he's been dead for a while. There's the knife. So it was used to kill himself. The mirror showed me this. Sharp. There's blood on the blade. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? I don't know. It looks like he killed himself. Still a little sticky. Okay, it hasn't been here long, or extremely long time, at least. Read it. Start to the bed a little. My dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you, and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best. I'll see you again. Love your devoted Lawrence. Man, at least he loved her. I should know his face. There are so few of us. I should know his face. <gasps> what the fuck? He's alive! Oh my god, Bigby, he's alive! What? What are you doing here? Let's get you back up. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing here? What's going on? We found you here, in your chair with what we thought was a fatal injury. We should call Swinehart, have him take a look at you. Wait a second on that snow. You know who I am? Yes. Good. You should. I have a few questions. Yeah, I need to get some info from you, buddy. Why? What? What's this about? We found your note. I made a decision. If 
for us. It felt like the only way out. There's always so another way out, buddy. I shot myself in the heart. Oh, I thought I'd be dead by now. It hurts like fucking hell. Because you're not in your heart. Actually, a little more to the center. Probably had a lung. Great. <sighs> At least that's how I think it happened. Things are a little fuzzy. Thought it was a bad dream. Why did you do it, Lawrence? I did it. I'm honestly just speechless. I was ashamed. I'm trying to pay attention to what's going on here. Sorry about the lack of commentary, guys. I'm just really intrigued with this. I did what I look happy. But you were away from what? She comes by. Make sure I'm okay. Why aren't you? Why aren't you together? I'm useless. Don't be like that. Come on, buddy. I don't want her to have to worry about me anymore. She's better off without me. Without me being here to drag her down. She deserves that. She's been through a lot. I just wish I could have done better by her. She's always been there for me. Go away. Uh, just fucking go away. I'm just gonna tell him that Why she's not? missing. What? Because. Oh no. He's not in the state to no. know that. No. No, no, no. I knew this would happen. Knew what would happen? Fucking Georgie. Georgie got a name. Who's Georgie? Uh, who's at the door? Do you? Are you expecting anyone? I'll see who it is. No, wait. We need to know why whoever's out there is breaking in. I need your help. What do I do? Just play Just dead. Play dead. Yeah, what? play dead. Trust me. You look dead. You can't move in your condition anyway, so just stay still. The second we figure out what they're here for, Bigby will arrest them. Think about your wife. You guys better hide. You're gonna get screwed. Come on, hide. Oh man, that was close. Who the hell are you? I don't know who that is. What's he doing? Is he looking for something? Yeah, obviously. Is that he has a gun. Why go through his books? Where's my wife, you motherfucker? Hey, listen. You don't want to do this, man. What did you do with my wife? I don't know what you're talking about, okay? I'm just a guy looking for answers too. Of course, got hey. stuck in the freaking door. Jesus. Big B, what are you doing? Just let listen. He's looking for answers. Answers to what? I don't know. Let's catch his ass and find out. Um, hey! Stop! <laughs> Leave me alone! Um, no, you just broke into the guy's house. Go. We got this. Hardcore parkour. Boom! Boom! Get your fucking ass back, you little bitch boy. 
go, 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 big, big, go. This one. There he is. Get his ass! It's telling me to press the left trigger, but I'm pressing right, and it's still working. Whatever. I ain't bitching. Man, fat guy can jump. Really, Bigby? He made it. And you couldn't even make it? Come on, dude. Oh, door. Oh, shit. Dude, you landed on top of him. There you go. Ease up, Bigby. We're on the same side here. You son of a bitch. Make me run after you. Why were you looking through books, huh? Same <laughs> thing you should be doing. Investigate. Why were you looking, looking through books? Clues. The fuck you doing hiding in closets? Fuck, man. Fuck, man! I'm asking the questions. You're looking for the woodsman, right? My employer is going to ask him a few questions, too. Who are, Who are you? you exactly? I'm D, and I'm a private investigator. Okay, so he's D. I don't know who that is. Pocket. You can see for yourself. This is for a sandwich shop. Huh? Really? Huh? Must have run out. You're very suspicious. You? I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand? Nope. Can't say that I do. Come on. You're coming with me. This could have been easy. Oh, don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no, to... No, I'm D. He's dumb. What? Oh, brother! Oh! <laughs> Punched me in the face. He almost looked peaceful. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty owl. Yep. yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. <laughs> Where'd they go? Well, after the one guy hit you and the other one finished kicking you. That explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, Wonderful. get up. We should check in on Toad, see if there's anything there that can get us back on the trail. And we ended up going out the window and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Yeah, looks worse than the day. I don't think anybody's here. We came all this way for nothing. <laughs> all right, son. All right, he's gone. He's left. It's over now. Awkward. I don't like the fact that the kid is crying. Is that his son? Toads, I think. Be nice in there, okay? I'll try. <laughs> Big B and Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Sorry, Bigby. 
it's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought there was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. <laughs> Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. Uh huh. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this. We heard someone crying. Oh, the boy stubbed his toe on the bed frame is all. It stings, you know, but it's nothing to kick up a fuss about. A little tub swim, he'll be right as rain, I'm sure. Is your son in there? Oh, he's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna... So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. Nope, sorry. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. Someone was here, and something's going on. And just so this trip wasn't a complete waste of time, I'm gonna look around a bit before we leave, okay? The longer you talk, the longer this takes. So just stand over there and shut up. All right, all right. Dude, why are you I just... Don't don't I didn't want to be mean. Uh, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. TJ? Are you all right? There you are. I don't mean to intrude, but Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection, and I was wondering if you could perhaps let me see it? It has a weevil. Cool. Hey, she's Clementine from the Walking Dead games. Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. First things first. Now this happened. Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh-huh. The lamp just fell off the table. All well, the boy was faffing about, playing salts and saltfish. Who knows with the lad? Thought he stubbed his toe on the bed frame. It's not even plugged in. What's that? The lock's busted too. This place is falling apart. Eh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. Oh, for Christ's sake, a fucking log's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just like everything else in this bloody building. Oh. Uh. This sounds painful. Oi, don't you go mothering now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Perks of being a fable, I suppose. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and a frog. Okay. Fire poker with blood on it. There's more blood over here. Oh, well, I'll cut me end. <laughs> Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a wrap. Must have got some on the furnishments. Sounds painful. Oi, don't you go mother ending now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Perks of being a fable, I suppose. Mm hmm. And a frog. Okay. Fire poker with blood on it. There's more blood over here. On the poker? Yeah. What happened? Oh, well, that's... That's how it happened, didn't it? I was... I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. Look like a shit ugly thing. If you're gonna say something, out with it. Your story's not adding up, buddy. Oh, it's a fire eye in this all, you ponderous wanker. We're not playing ten little Indians here. It's a simple accident. No, he didn't. He didn't talk his way out of it. Oh, my God. Will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? Because you're lying. I mean, things happen, you know. This apartment's a goddamn mess, Toad. Looks like after a struggle or a fight. And I don't know why you cover for it. But I know you're lying about something. But I'm not... And you're just going to make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. Exactly. I'm not... Bullshitting you. Honest. We'll see. I don't know. I'm sorry again, guys. I'm running out of commentary. I'm trying to think of what to say. 
I'm just so into this game. Like, you get immersed into games like this, and it's just so amazing how, like, involved you get what and how focused now? you if can be. Blood, you know what happened, I... No, there's marks here on the windowsill. And what's that about? No real reason. Just last night when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright dizzy, mate, as you would be. And <laughs> I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. You're not making sense. Really? Scared Junior off to death. Just uh, none of it adds up. I fucked up on the first one because I didn't pick a choice real quick. You heard uh, the new uh, Shaking Stevens album yet? Hmm. <laughs> Okay, Sheriff. Now what? Yeah, you wouldn't need keys. Keys. Since the lock's broken, so why'd you climb in through the window? Huh? Why'd you climb in through the window? You said it yourself. The lock's been rotten for weeks. You wouldn't have needed a key to get in. Fucking hell. Just what are you on about, mate? After the state I was in, I didn't have me head. That's all it was. I forgot the fucking handle was fucking busted. And I'll tell you what else. It's embarrassing you bringing all this shit up, all right? So quit it with a third degree and all that. Is there anything else? <laughs> mm, sorry about that snooze. There's a mark over here, too. What do you mean? There's a clean space in the dust over here. Oh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something? I mean, who knows? No, that's where the lamp was. Dude, do you not? Just tell me. Why are you being a butthead? Oh, yo, Bigby, what sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running? Didn't stop the recycling? Nope. What's the point of all this, mate? Really? You're lying to me. Why are you lying to me? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because the lamp was always over here, Toad. Yep. It was over here. Exactly. And now it's, now it's there. there. The space in the dust <laughs> is from where you well, moved I did it. some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Bloody hell, mate. Come on. Get off with this. Bigby, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon, just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this, the sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I called, really I am, but will you please, please just bugger off. Just tell me the truth. Not yet. Not yet? No one fought anyone, Bigby, there wasn't any scrap. So when? When are you going to leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here, in me own bloody home. It's not seemly. When? When you start telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Don't oh my God! How long is this gonna go on, dude? Just, it's obvious. Toad. Nah, I'm not gonna these threaten him. Stories have made no sense. Yeah, they don't make any sense you at all. Forget Where's your the keys? keys. You didn't bump the lamp off the table. You want to tell me what's going on? He also he didn't. Think much of me. I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? You also didn't cut your hand or foot. Hey, look, there's Mr. blood. Toad, you're bleeding. Take off the hat. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a tweedle, thumb or D. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. And if you had come in when I asked you to, maybe he wouldn't have had the nerve to strong arm me boy. He hurt Toad Jr. Oh my god. How awful. What the hell does he care? It's always the same with I you, do care. Thing. It's Before just... Trouble, need help. If I call about something, you always take a live long day to get here. What if he done something worse, eh? I'm tired of feeling trivial, mate. A lot of us are. 
We're sorry, TJ. Yeah. Really. We were lucky it didn't go any further. You know where the Tweedle went? He mentioned something about Prince Lawrence's. I don't know if he'd already been there, was going there, but... He was going there. He said there. something about it. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. Oh, man. I even tried to give the bows to the coat. He wouldn't take it. The coat. coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Uh, sometimes. Borrow. Wow. Don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. You will merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the <laughs> coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. <laughs> Hello, why do you have it hidden? If you just borrowed it. Ew, it's the donkey skin. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Wait. There's a note. Or a letter. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. What do you want to do with it? Gotta give it to the prince. Doesn't seem right opening another man's mail. Let's try and give it to him. Okay. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. Sorry, bro. Who knows what would have happened to Lawrence if I wouldn't have went. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. And don't worry about what happened earlier. Just feel better, okay? Snow White uh, seems like a good mom. Try down at the trip trap. The trip trap. Well, guess we're going to find Woodsy. Does it always go that smoothly? No, not often. So, split a cab? Sure. I can only go to the trip trap for now, anyway. Not because of what Toad said. Hopefully, the woodsman's there. I don't know. Someone who will know where to find it. It's my best lead. Our only lead, really. Yeah, really. When he put it that way. <laughs>